have the right to sue us when we take decisions in our own interests, then we've we've thought we've lost a lot of sovereignty, we've lost a lot of democracy. And given that this is, I see the two things as being connected. Uh, the Canada-China Investment Treaty has to be stopped within the next uh, few days, so it's uh, the stakes are very high. Thank you. Can you hold that up where you were holding it? Before yeah, I get a this is, this, I'm afraid this is one I, I put a plant on, so it got some dirt on it. This is the Canada China Investment Treaty. They'll be speaking about this when my time comes to speak. I'll be speaking at around 1 o'clock, the organizers say. And I'll focus on this piece, and uh, I hope we can get uh, Christy Clark, his premier, to step up and go to court to stop Stephen Harper from ratifying this without the express permission of the British Columbia government. Elizabeth, the government argues that we need a second market, and that's what the Asian and the Ember <coughs> represents. Is that, is that a genuine argument? We have case? lots of markets, and one of the markets we ought to be dealing with is Eastern Canada, where in the rest of Canada, 55% of the oil we use in the country is imported. So there are other markets, and if we're going to look at China, we need to look at other ways to deal with that. Putting super tankers on our coastline is not an option. Yeah, the domestic market is never counted as the other market. It's just no. the Americans consider it's, the, it's always been a north-south market flowing from Canada down to the U.S. Now they want to put the bitumen on tankers heading to China. It's inherently an unsafe proposition. We won't stand for it. We need to be phasing out our dependency on fossil fuels, not ramping it up and finding uh, new places to ship dangerous fuel. What does the opposition in the House say about FIPA? Uh, unfortunately, I've been the only member of Parliament who's been pursuing this matter, so uh, I will continue to push it as hard as I can. Thanks a lot. Thank you.